So we said, <clears throat> Zeke, great call, you 4275. And then they said, I think the next key target should be that's going to try to get to that 4546. Jay, nice, nice uh, call over here with your 45 zone. Just felt like that would be the next potential target because this is a trap bar right here, and they've been swinging back and forth. So as long as you don't try to call a direction right now, you'll be fine. But in, in range trade, the way we said, but I believe that there it is right there. There's your 46. And I showed you how to figure that trade, right? Because this is a squeeze trade right now. And everybody who's trying to predict a, a direction right now is getting killed. Because this is too low for the demon. Can't just use this because all of this is available for the bots. And still, you know, this, so this is a little deceiving today to use this kind of stuff. That's why I said you're, you're almost better off just looking at a chart like this. And we've been making a megaphone and swinging both sides. So anybody that's attempted to call a directional trade is going to be wrong five times, like on a trend day, trying to guess against it, you're going to be wrong five times. All right, anybody get that just got to that 46 zone? And that retest the overnight high, that's what we had in mind. Back in here. Over here, so you can see it. And that's what I had in mind when I said I think they're going to go test 46. Coming into lunch, and this is a squeeze type trade. The longs have definitely, you know, uh, tracked traders from their 32 support that we've called. But we also are still making this pattern of lower um, highs. So that has got to change for the longs to have any long-term success. And my suggestion, if you're flat, you don't have to take the trades that I, that I call. I hope you take your own trades and not the ones I call. But that was something that I could just see the mechanics of that trade. So if you're sidelines, you can jump in any time you want and try to grab two, three points. Thank you. I think that, um, and I said earlier today, when you weren't here, you were shoveling snow, whatever it was you were doing, I said the potential today could be for an even bigger megaphone, but I didn't think we would get that. But that may be something that happens overnight. And that would be the one that will confuse everybody if we get it. In other words, if we take take out that 52 zone, 54 zone, and get to your 58 target, if we get up there, then it's still going to be a, a solid zone that shorts will try. And I said there's a you know good possibility because we're, we're trying to hold this. I mean, this is the pipe we're in. We know that. And I think today this, because we said 32, 34 support are broken. And clearly the market has done that. So I don't want to be overly aggressive short side, and I don't want to be overconfident long either. But I do think that the, you know this was a trap and a squeeze on low volume to serve notice to to the short take. Hey, you know I'm not going to just roll over. But we're we're still waiting on time. That's the problem. So I'm still saying range type trading. That's what we had in mind today. Auction off this territory down here that was not auctioned off yesterday and still range type trading for now. And coming into lunch, I would not be overly aggressive. Uh, this guy right here is going to be key. 
you said that you know it's coming into play today or tomorrow. So I'm giving credit to the longs for defending, and I'm also giving credit for the shorts having played defense this morning. But it seems like anybody trying to call directional moves are, are going to get hurt. So I don't want to call directional moves. I want to say let's we're going to trade inside that range, and if it breaks, we know where it's going. And it may happen, you know, when someone's out at lunch or taking a walk or whatever. But this is a squeeze trade, and directionally, right now. We said this is going to be our key. So getting its head right back up above here, you've got to give the, the longs credit for that. And their goal is to knock out this guy now. And that may come during lunch, it may not. So coming into lunch, if you've had a good morning, lock it up. We said down here, you got to lock it up. We said down here, if you're taking this, this swing trade right here, testing this low, you got you got to cover into the... 35s to 34s and trail. This bar right here is the bar. That's the trap em bar. Swing loads, rotate, and now come back up and square it off. So don't give as much attention to this blue line, but pay attention to the pink line today. Because this we're going over and under. And a 15 minute chart, you still want to pay attention to that this has been an important chart. 